It's, uh, it's a Monday morning. Well, maybe even lunchtime by now. Uh, that's my solar panel. Uh, busily collecting solar as we speak, solar energy. Um, one good thing, it's a bl totally blue sky today. And the sun is out. There's the sun. Up there somewhere. Yeah. So, good time to collect energy from the sun. Uh, like a number of people, I was quite uh, surprised to learn that this little thing, the split relay unit, is bi-directional. So uh, I've hooked it all back up and uh, when the solar panel, can you see that, is working, uh, it's not just, well it's actually charging the data battery uh, as well as the uh, solar battery, uh, the leisure battery. Fascinating really. None of us, well I haven't suspected it, quite a few other people have haven't apparently, according to the Facebook group I'm in. Um, as usual we're all cluttered, it's on my list of things to do, is to offload some of this clutter somewhere <sighs> at some point. Um, trouble with not having much to do is it makes it very hard to do the few things that you do have to do because I don't know about anybody else but my motivation flies out the window, yeah. Uh, hence the more than possibly usual clutter in here. Uh, I've tried several times, had varying degrees of success sorting it out. Oh, that's good. Just found this nice candle in here. Look, lovely little candle. I'll use that later. I've ordered another USB rechargeable lamp because I've had two now, and the main point of weakness is the actual bit where you shove in the micro USB bit to charge it yeah that's always the weak point and it's the bit that on the uh, lamp itself that goes so I've ordered another one and I'll just have to be very very careful when I'm uh, plugging it in uh, so I'm gathering uh, electricity here not sure if you can see that right now so um, we currently got 2.5 amps coming in so that's good uh, particularly today because I'm not intending to drive anywhere today I'm working this morning and then uh, I'll be working again this evening we're running an online meeting so this afternoon I'm going to go and explore up the canal from here I'll take some pictures uh, I'm going to go and explore uh, an area I've never been to to get my bit of uh, exercise and uh, countryside <laughs> yeah um, I've been feeding the local blackbirds these they must have babies I think anyway uh, eating these at a rate or not <laughs> yeah um, what else have I been up to I spent quite a bit of time in Leamington yesterday in Warwick actually went for a bit of a walk um, attended an online Bible meeting, sat in Warwick Square outside the museum, uh, drinking a cup of coffee from a cafe, the Tuckery, which happened to be open for uh, takeaway, so that was good. Uh, yeah, um, came home, cooked myself a roast dinner, as pork was very cheap in Tesco, and uh, also at the same time cooked uh, cauliflower and chickpea curry, which I'll be having for dinner tonight. Uh, other exciting news, I had to replace one of these bottles because uh, it had a weakness around here and uh, it's normally okay if I have about three of them. Um, I find that's just about the right amount of water if I do go off somewhere just for a quiet bit of time. So I bought another one of still water in Tesco yesterday, that was a pound 10p, gone up 10 pence since the... Uh, commotion and there's a smaller bottle as well which is a handy size but I don't know where it's currently gone things sort of go to ground in vans other people have noticed that you put something down I got my citalopram script uh, I picked some up more next last week enough for a couple of months uh, thank god I uh, don't think now would be the right time to start reducing my citalopram I've been managing to cope but I've had moment, days of utter, utter, utter depression really when I've got very low. Um, the weird thing about being here is that it's lovely and it's got, I've got everything I need in the uh, mobile home behind me, which I don't want to show you in case anybody recognises where it is. But 
It can just get very isolated because I'm out of my normal place where I normally live. Um, I normally live in Leamington, uh, have the normal life. So I drive over a lot of days and I find that if I drive over to Leamington and have a bit of time just walking around the park, etc., catching up with whoever happens to be about, then, uh, you know, at a social distance, um, I find that helps me then for the rest of the day. But today I'm staying here. Like I say, I'm going for a little walk this afternoon and working this evening, so uh, um, I can work from home today. I don't have to go and uh, deliver any food or anything to anyone, or medicines or anything like that. So, yeah, so that should work out quite well. So, yeah, onwards with the working now. Uh, just thought I'd take a couple of minutes break while I had to go and get myself washed and dressed anyway and do the little bit of washing up. So now it's time for another cup of coffee and crack on with a bit more work uh, so that I can go out of the survey. Anyway, that's me.